What's up, YouTube? Hope you guys are out there building shit. Believing your own two god getting hands, taking on new projects, learning new skills, building, fixing, creating, doing art. Anyways, so if you follow the channel, you know that I'm building this ramp truck. If you don't follow the channel, hi, this workshop, this is my ramp truck, building it on an extreme tight budget. It won't do a guy much good without a set of ramps to get things up on it. So like most Americans these days, they're on a budget, trying to get something cheap. We jump on Amazon, we jump on eBay, we try to find something. We try the Amazon ramps, but they filled up with water. They were super weak. They had a weird, this uh, crappy cheap paint on them that just made them just chintzy. I really didn't like them. I ended up sending those now, right back. I ponied up a whole 20 more bucks, and I ordered a set from eBay. But I'm going to show you guys in the ad. It says, if I didn't like this set, that it was a $75 return shipping. And I was a real, real hesitant to order them and not like them after I just ordered that. Sending them right back into the box and right back to Amazon where they came from. But I'm going to show these things to you. And I'm going to give them my stamp of approval, my endorsement. I think they're going to be great ramps. They, they feel heavier right when I picked up the box. They feel stronger. Uh... The welds are better. They didn't fill up with water overnight. Um, they just feel like a way better ramp. And so I'm glad that I got this set now. I'm glad that I ponied up the extra 20 bucks. So let's check. Them. So before I even pull these ramps out of the box, I'm going to say this. Picking this box up and loading it into the car, you can tell these got some weight to them. The other set, they weren't as heavy. They weren't as heavy of a gauge, there wasn't as much metal used because these, this box is definitely heavier, definitely uh, harder to pick up for me than the other box was of the, uh, the Amazon ones. These ones came from eBay. This set is actual aluminum, not that cheap paint over aluminum that's just going to chip, chip off. I'd rather scratch it in my aluminum than chipped off gray and then aluminum that is just gonna look goofy after a while. So, my thoughts and observations on these ramps versus the other ones. These have definitely stronger, thicker uh, rectangle tube. I definitely like that these ones don't have anything welded to it or to catch. It's just one solid plate. This is definitely gonna give you some great traction. I don't necessarily like their finish work at the ed ends. It's a little bit sharp could use the grinder something to kind of uh, just round it off make it look a little more finished but overall I think that these are a better deal I think that these are a stronger uh, ramp I think they're better made rain test the last set of ramps we ordered the best quips they filled with water that's the water dripping out of there these no water inside Gives you a little more confidence in the welds that they don't fill up with water in the rain, eh? If you guys are going to order a set of, of trailer ramps, don't be afraid of that uh, $75 return shipping deal. Just go ahead and order them. It's a, they feel like a good sturdy set of ramps. So, But I haven't loaded nothing with them yet. I will give that disclaimer. And I also will say they did not endorse this video. They did not give me this product for free or nothing. I used my own money and bought this stuff. My channel's not big enough yet to get any kind of uh, handouts or freebies or anything like that. Alright guys, so hopefully this video helps somebody out uh, that was looking to order some aluminum trailer ramps from eBay or Amazon. I'd just go with the eBay ones. I think they're a stronger ramp, a better deal, uh, better quality. But if it helped you out, hit like. You want to see more videos from me? More content on the ramp truck build or whatnot? Hit that subscribe button, guys. Until next time, believe in what God gave you. Take on some projects. Build something. Fix something. Create something. Do something with your hands today, guys. Do something positive that you can look at it at the end of the day and you know what you accomplished. Don't be sitting around idle. Don't be doing the devil's work, guys. Till next time, keep building shit.